you see me really well. But I call myself, oh, how y'all doing? You all right? But I call myself leaving school early, which is 9.45 p.m. for me. I was working on a new idea design design wise for um how i present my lessons and stuff and i'm thinking about maybe trying uh teachers pay teachers it's a it's a site where teachers buy resources and so on and so forth so i leave in i'm like oh i'm gonna get cozy be cozy tonight because i got my weighted blanket in here now and that way the blanket is cozy, cozy rosy. And so I get in the car, you know, get all my stuff up in here. <laughs> and I kind of wipe off my makeup and stuff before I go. So I just use some toilet paper to wipe it down, right? So I get up in this car and she won't start. So I texted by her and said, well, car won't start. <laughs> And she was like, what are you doing? I said, sitting here eating some butter pretzels. What I'm going to be freaking out for? Technically, I can crawl to the back and be fine. And where I'm parked, it has a little light and it's right off the street. So it's not like it's in a remote area where it's dark. That would be the side of the school. But now I park somewhere else. And I was like, I probably wouldn't mind so much, but if something went down, which I don't think it would, but I don't know. But if something went down, I can't even d d speed off. You know what I'm saying? And I know it's a battery. I know for a fact it's a battery. It was on his last leg. Now you have those unexpected expenses. Are you trying to make it to that payday? <laughs> but you know what? It is what it is. See, we're all going to go through things in life. It's inevitable. We're all going to go through ups and downs in life. But the thing that sets you apart from others is how you handle the things that you go through in life. What, what I'm be crying and, and, and freaking out for, it is what it is. If something's going to happen, something's going to happen. And I was going to ask this lady, and it's kind of late, you know, if she can give me a jump because she gave me a jump before. But she's in bed and not feeling well. So I was like, oh, I don't want to bother her. But technically, like I said before, I could crawl to the back and, you know, just thug it out. Thug it out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so then I texted um, one of my coworkers. I said, you with your boo thing? You know, hoping she with the boo thing, right? <laughs> she was like, no, I just got home. So, she, and I told her what happened. And she said, you got cables? I was like, yo. And... She says, well, I don't know how to jump a car. I said, me neither. I said, but there are instructions on my cables. And, you know, I have an idea. I said, but there are instructions on the cables. I said, she said, well, you want me to come? Because she lives really close to the school. I said, I guess we can try to be a rebel. <laughs> and we can try to figure it out. So, I don't know if she's going to come. So, I'm just sitting here. And so I'll get a battery this week. I just need to make it, you know, you know, it is what it is. Sometimes you, you trying to make it paycheck to paycheck. It is what it is. And so I'm trying to cover, recover from some other expenses and so on and so forth. And I made some decisions that I'm starting to regret, but it is what it is. You live and you learn. That's what life is about. Living you learn. And it was the first time I've tried this. Living you learn. So here I am. Seeing if she's gonna come with her fancy infinity. We'll see how that goes. And I'm here eating my pretzels and chips. My favorite snack. I got some sour cream and onion chips 
And these pretzels right here, these are good pretzels. They're good. And just take it in and try. But you know the weird thing is? I don't, I, this part I don't understand. The light is on, but the car won't start. Or is it just enough charge where it won't start the car, but it can do, you know, small things, but like the lights. So that's the weird thing to me. What, what the light on for? So, I don't know. And then I'm right off the street. So, my head is on swivel. Doors locked and so. But really, nothing really, it, it rarely happens out here. But, you know, just the idea of not being able to... You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind if I could in a hurry. But I can't. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let me see what she's doing or if she's coming. Day in the life in Basil's world. Day in the life. It's like, I feel bad saying this. Because there's nothing that makes me so special. Why not me? It's like, I've been down, up, down, up. So many times in life that when I'm down, I'm like, I'll be up. I don't know when I'll be up, but I'll be back up again. Because when you're going through the hard times, it's not hard times. All the time. There are moments of joy. Moments where you have a break. You know what I mean? So just ride it out. Whatever you're going through, ride it out. Crying ain't gonna fix it. Mm -mm. Crying not gonna fix it. I know, but sometimes you just need to let it out. I think I was upset one day. And... I cried, but I, I gave myself like two seconds. I, uh, that's enough. <laughs> I was like, mm -mm. Joy, that's it. That's it, Joy. I was like, I'm not going to do this. Knock the day. All right, y'all. Let me get out of here. <laughs> not like I'm going somewhere, <laughs> but my hand is hurting. <laughs> holding this phone. Well, at least I have my buddy right here, right? I got my buddy. Hey, bye-bye. Well, at least with that there, they know that somebody crazy up in this car. And now, I have to go to the bathroom. And I texted the cleaning lady, because once you come out at a certain um, hour, you can't get back in. And I texted the cleaning lady to see if um, the male guy who cleans, if he was there. But I don't think she's seen my text. And I don't think she can uh, read English well. It is what it is. All right, y'all. I'll keep you posted. Bye, y'all. Okay, guys. I am up and... I'm up and running. So my coworker came to help a sister out. And so she um, came with her fancy little infinity, okay, driving in style. And my cables are kind of new, so they have instructions, a piece of paper instructions. She was scared, I was scared. She was like, see, I wish, and I said, no, this is girl power. We can read. I said, I don't know what I'm doing. You don't know what you're doing, but I know what we both can do. We can both read. <laughs> so we, we read the instructions and hooked it up. I was a little nervous, but I was like, whatever is going to happen, is going to happen. So I'm letting the car run a few, few minutes, and then I should start tomorrow. I think when I put the car, like where the car is not running, 
and I just like um, put it on just to listen to the radio or something like that. I think it still runs the car. I think I have to turn it on and then, t then turn the car off because that's what happened the last time I didn't start the car but I turned it on just so I could roll down the window to talk to my friend and then then I just turned it off because I was parked but I think it's something in the system where it still runs my battery and that's what happened today I came out to my car to do something no oh when I parked this morning I was still listening to the radio and I didn't want to run run the car so I turned the car off and just turned it so I could hear the radio and then I went into school but I think there's something where my car is still using that juice from the battery does that make sense so I think future well I'll be getting the battery tomorrow how about that Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Woo. And so, that's how my evening goes. It is now 11.14. She was like, well, why didn't you just call me sooner? I said, I didn't want to bother anybody. And I didn't think of her automatically. And so, I was just looking at my phone. And I know she lives close. And I was like, well, let me just try her. She came. We did that. Yes, we did. So, will she start in the morning? I have no idea. So, let me lock my doors. I don't know. I always do that <laughs> several times. So, I just didn't feel comfortable right here because I wasn't, you know, I, mm -mm, and I just can't drive off. Now, where I'm going now, I feel comfortable. And there's always somebody watching me. So, I feel comfortable. It's quiet. Uh, and I'd be cozy back there. So, I'd rather do that than sit here like a sitting duck. Although, I think I could have done it, but I didn't want to. Alright, y'all. <sighs> Just wanted to give you the update that a sister is rolling again. Alright, I will check in with you guys later. Bye, y'all.